This is Paul with Shirley Fabrication, Tuscaloosa, Alabama. I'm over here at Tyler Shop. I'm gonna do a video. We got several rigs that are ready to go, man. And it's just kind of like showcasing our work. You know, we are very versatile in what we do. We can do direct flow cookers. We can do reverse flow cookers, which we are highly known for. We can do grills. We can do Santa Maria grills. We can do combinations of grills. But I'm gonna walk through and just show you because I'm gonna showcase our work. And I'm very proud of these guys. Uh, this right here is a 24 by 36 Santa Maria. It has the uh, flat uh, square square bar grate. We, use, we do round bar grates on a lot of them, but this Santa Maria here, it just goes up and down just like most Santa Maria's right here locks. You can come to the end right here. You can open this up. You've got a big ash pan down there in the bottom. This comes out right here for your charcoal. Notice everything we build is going to be built heavy duty. Has a removable tongue on this trailer. Right here, stainless shelf that runs all the way. Hold down shelf, carbon steel shelf right here with a uh, paper tile holder. Pro port right here on this right here. You have a vertical cooker on the back. Does a couple of things. You can either direct cook in here. You can move some of these grates out. It's a bunch of grates. But you can direct cook in here, live fire, just putting charcoal and stuff in that pan right there. Or you can take this grate out, leave your pan in there to catch any drippings. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven grates there. Uh, got a bee, bait, bee basket right here, charcoal pan under there, I mean a ash pan under there. So you can build your fire in the bee, bee basket. It'll, uh, and you can use this as a vertical smoker. Excellent cooker, excellent cooker. Uh, again, you can just grill, live fire yep. grill right there. Mm -hmm. uh, got LED lights on the trailers. This cooker here, we built some of them that you can go from the vertical into the Santa Maria at, with a damper system where you can feed feed that cooker too and use it as a smoker. But uh, you can do numbers of things with our cooker. All right, now I'm gonna go over here. This is a slick rig right here. Really slick, very small cooker. 36 elevated cabinet model with a hip roof. Tight looking, man, tight looking. Come right over here. Uh, you see your grape? Our grapes are built out of one by one by quarter. Compare apples to apples now, guys. First flow cooker, pro, 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 gaskets on the doors, dual burners up front. Uh, down here, this firebox, this is a quarter inch firebox, isn't it, Rob? Let me look, it is. Firebox right here. It is. Uh, you got a grape right here, tight grape right here. They got the new. Tyler and them's on the plasma tables cutting out some new stuff. They got handles already incorporated in these right here. Uh, LED light, got a little wood box over here. It is a tight looking cooker, man. Really, really tight looking cooker. But I don't think they wanted a griddle up front. Got the stuff. It can have stainless ball valve up front, uh, custom wheels and tires. This right here, you have never seen one of these. I built this. Uh, this cooker right here is a 48 Santa Maria, elevated Santa Maria. Let me tell you what the options are on this right here. So, uh, I feel like doing some things to it. I haven't got the grates in it or anything. I haven't put the grate in it or anything. There at my house, I got that tight too. But anyway, you got three different levels where you can do different. You can be up tight and close here or real low over here. You can, uh, it'll have an ash pan in here. Have two grates, one on that side, one on this side. You can be up far away down here, smoking, cooking, whatever you do. You can be right over there, live fire cooking. Yep. Uh, it also has a... That's a round bar. Round, round bar grate right here. It has a rotisserie on it. So you, this rotisserie can go up and down, but it just easily boats right on and boats right off. So really slick, and then you can see, I don't have some of the handle stuff on there, but you could go way up here if you wanted to. But uh, if you were going to use a rotisserie, uh, you would want to uh, you would want to probably lower it down. But you have the options to do whatever you want to do. So this rotisserie easily moves off, takes off, five minute job. Uh, big heavy duty lid right here. I'll show you like that. You can take this off right here, this fit and stuff. You can still close your lid and stuff right there. All oh, that still hooked That's up. That's right. We, we designed that right. So uh, that is little tight trailer. Y'all look at this very low profile trailer, really low profile tires. And that's really what I built my four wheeler trailer out of. It, it all is. runs it all the time. All the time. Excellent, doesn't it? It does great. Good looking trailer. Now right I love slick. this. Got a wood basket up front. Uh, I'd like this. to have that thing. Oh, it's a bad grill. It's bad, dude. 
It's a Santa Maria, a direct grill. It can be used as an offset smoker because you've got a stack on that end, one on this end. Put your fire stuff over there, put you some butts. Butts over here, close that stack, open that stack. You're drafting out like a direct flow cooker. We bad to the bone now. I'm going to tell you, guys, we are not playing. Here's a cooker right here. I've covered up the name. I do not want to slander anybody's name, talk bad about them. But this cooker here, we've had to repair it, do a bunch of work to it. And I'm telling you, it ought not even be in our shop. It's not even comparable to what we build. Uh, we just happen to be doing some stuff. I'll show you right here. Uh, if I can figure out what all this stuff does. Look at the thickness on these doors right here. You see right there, one eight thick. Probably the bifle. I don't even know what it is. But anyway, we're repairing it, doing some work to it, adding stuff on it to make it work right. So, uh, when you talk about the bowl, it's about people, oh, our cookers, uh, yeah, you'll buy a cheap cooker, but guess what? Then you're gonna come to me to fix it. So anyway, <laughs> there it is. Uh, I mean, it's just the truth. So there it is right there. We had to pop holes in here. This thing was seal welded. I don't know what they were thinking about. It was uh, about a foot of water in it wasn't wrong. That is several inches, yeah. But, so we had, had to anyway. But anyway, we repair cookers too. And uh, it helped me because I realized how good we are. Or That's what right. What a job we do. And I, yeah, I'm bragging on our guys. Absolutely. Come over here, you'll see out here. Let's go out here right quick, Ron. See these guys got a big job out here going on, a big job out here at the concrete plant, a big, uh, what is that? Do you know what's some a, sort of separator? A, it's a bin, it's gravel, sand, rock, whatever. Of, it'll have actuators on it and everything right. else on it. That's okay, right. let's ease downtown down here where it's really going on. Uh, each of these guys got work tables. They got a new CNC high definition for wiki plasma table outside. It has helped a lot, hasn't it, Rob? Yes, the I love it. The things we had to hand cut, I mean, think about what we were doing. Or y'all, y'all. And back doing. in the day, you were, you were out there with a Matabo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, got a cooker right here going on. Quentin's welding on it. Uh, show them the weld, Rob. Always, always slick, slick, slick. Always slick, slick, slick. Y'all already know what I have to show you. So, let's go right here, Rob. Got a thousand foot of ornamental fence going up right here. Uh, in Gorgo, Alabama, outside in the country, out of cemetery, that'll go up soon. And this is where the real deal is. This is real down here. <laughs> so, uh, go ahead and show y'all what we got right here. Got some slick stuff down here, don't we, Cody? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Cody and Cameron, this is their area down here. One side is for sandblasting, one side is for paint, and the other side is to store the cookers. And look right up there. That's what we're about, right up there on that wall. You understand what we stand for? We stand for liberty. Or dealt the Second Amendment and the American flag. That's who we support. We support Amen. our veterans and we support what they stand for. Okay. If you don't want to support them, get the H E block block out of the <laughs> United States. But you ain't gonna do it because it's great. <laughs> so anyway, right here we got a what is this? A Twenty-four by elevated thirty-six, right, Rob? That's I'm, right. I'm just That's right. It. That's right. Stainless steel shelf. It had the linseed finish to it. I mean, I'm not that crazy about it. I'd rather have the high tech clear. I would too. But, uh, you see, you got three great plugs out here. You know, two, four, six, 18 bucks in this cooker right here. So slick, slick, hilt proof. Uh, also, check this out. Oh, I love check this. Check this out. Everybody else will be doing it for long, but check this out. So Paul hides a cat back on Halloween today. So this <laughs> road goes up like there locks. You got your Santa Maria right here. Look at that. Look at that. Ain't we, ain't we slick? Oh, this is bad. Everybody be doing it next, won't they, Rob? They will. They hate us because they ain't us. That's what I say. But anyway, there that is right there, man. You got a deflector plate. You got the fire basket right here. You got a rotisserie that'll go on this thing, too. Oh, ash pan right there. Man, it's slick. Let me see what I'm doing. How'd I get this thing? Slip that little handle around. Oh, okay, my bad. Let's let it back down. Goes back down, round bar great. It'll never uh, hold up. Lift that yeah. handle right there. Huh? Show me. Okay. See, that got all these actuators slick stuff on. Very slick cooking. 3 8 thick cook chamber, man. Right here, got the same thing, man. Except different. This is, a, this is just a standard 36 model. Uh, looks like he's got a little griddle that's going to go on there, too. Stainless shell. Uh, golf cart steering up there. Table right here, where well, this goes up, same thing, same thing as the other one. Look at here. This one's got a rotisserie and also a griddle. So, yeah. So, Ross, you got to tell me again, son, what I do. This there one, it is. Then that other one. Y'all know I just come over here and do videos because I love doing videos. You know what? <laughs> I do not do it. You know why? 
Why? Well, I'm good at it. You are, anyway, you are good at it. But anyway, all right, this is a bad boy here. Let me tell you about this. If this got clear coat or, or uh, clear coat, high temp clear. High temp clear coat. This is an elevated charcoal grill. The gentleman wanted all the welds exposed. Slick rig. Slick. Look at that. Right there. So you got different options with the charcoal and stuff right there. You got a bunch of different options, a couple of different options, but you got three, actually. One, two, three. So there that is, man. Slick charcoal grill right there. Oh, man, man, man. Very slick. See how it folds up? Goes down, boom, boom. Look at all that. There that is. Oh, it's got a deep top on it where you can stand whole birds up in that thing. Again, this cooker's got the wagon wheel model on it. This is a 50 inch cooker. Fold down, it's kind of a shelf. Shelf that runs all the way. Rotated warmer. Oh. Here you go. Look at all that. It's got an extra V basket in it. Different tracks for grates right there. Uh, hip roof. Hip roof right there. Elevated warmer with a hip roof. Look at all the different things you got right here. You got a round bar grate for, for hot, searing real hot. You got an elevated charcoal grate slides out. Or you can go with our twin dual damper system that we developed. Yep. You know, we came up with. Anyway, let's go right up here, Rob. He's got the standard fire basket in here too. Look at here. Woo! Look at him. What he can do? He can slide in a grate in there. Oh, that's cool. And do a reverse sear on that. I didn't even see that. Oh yeah, I like that. He can do a reverse sear on that grate too. He got a half inch box. Yep, half inch fire box right there. Ash pan. Again, our dual damper system that we are highly well known for. Right here. Boom, 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 boom. boom, boom. <laughs> uh, right here, you see the slick welds, everything's slick. Again, let's go right here. Okay, this is going to be a 24 by 36 wagon wheel model, custom golf cart tires. Got the Shirley bottle opener, Pro Pro Pro, fold, fold down stainless shelf. Look at him. He's got a V basket with his too. Extra V basket and regular basket. So we don't have three levels of brakes right there, guys. Drip bars on the doors. Uh, if they buy the V basket, they get the standard basket with it. Yeah. All right, here you go, right here. Kaboom, there it is. You see, Ross, now I'm not doing mine like that yet, my fire basket, uh, because I had some pre built, but he, they're cutting the holes where you can just reach in here and grab it. That's cool. Uh, that is a that is a griddle right there, Ross. What is that? That's now? a that's an ash pan. Tyler leaned it out for whatever reason. Oh, okay, so that's an ash pan. Cool. So clean out two right there. Uh, Man, look, tell you guys, there's nothing we can't do if we just, if you want it done. Uh, we're not big in the vertical insulated cooker. Don't, I don't want to ever be one, do we, Rob? No. 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 So again, right here, it comes out, locks. Put your live fire in there, put you some charcoal grill in there. You can be grilling in here, smoking in here. You can be grilling in here, not doing nothing over there. You can come in here, cold smoke in here. You can take this out. Cold smoke in here. Hang you sauces. can grill cold smoke. You do that warmer. Got sausage rods, sticky some birds up there, hanging some ribs on there. Do whatever you want to do. Ain't nobody gonna stop you. The sky's the limit. So don't be scared, just do it. Oh, I love it. Come on around here. I love it. Come on, come on with it. Wow, what is this? Looky, looky, looky. Looky, looky, looky. Here you go. Come on, boss. 36 on a tray. Another 36. Custom fenders right here. I'm gonna get a sledgehammer and get on them fenders like I did one time before. Y'all remember that? If you've been watching me a while, look, y'all go on my YouTube channel, like it, subscribe to it, and share it. You know, that helps us. I don't do near as many videos as I used to. Uh, one dude, most people love it. One dude's wife says she couldn't stand it, cut it off. Cause uh, she don't like the way I talk. I, I'm a redneck, you know what? Yep. Well, I'd be a red, rather be a redneck than living in New York City. Yep. You can't even care going. Good Lord from heaven. No fair protest. Good God Almighty, man. What? I, I wouldn't want it neither. No. Heck no. Uh, the grates and stuff aren't in here. But anyway, they'll go in there. It's just another slick, slick. Come around here and show them the bell. Let them see how slick it is. They already know. I don't have to tell them. They struggling to get there. They they trying. This is oh, one old dude loves them. No, never mind. This I is Nick Nick Castillo. That Gabe that Tyler went hunting in Texas. Yeah, Gabe. Yeah. Okay, y'all. It's, it's, it's his took brother. It off a cart. Took it off a car. Took it off a car and put it on this trailer. Oh, Nick, I like Nick. He's a good guy. Another big cooker back here. Is this a new one? Or is this a rebound too? Oh, this is a rebound. Rebound. Okay, we rebound cooker. But look, we ain't been a rebound no cooker for two or three hundred dollars. Blasting it's gonna be about five hundred. If you send a cooker here and it's dirty. 
automatically $250 to clean that cooker. No I'm doubt. tired of cleaning chicken bones out of your cooker for you. Yeah. So I'm not going to do that. Clean no. your doggone cooker. So automatically, you're going to get charged $250 to clean that cooker. Mm -hmm. So I'd get your wife out there with a spatula or something, or your boys while they're in there watching the computer, get them out there with the uh, spatula and tell them to clean the cooker up. I mean, no, I mean, not Lord. But anyway, uh, you're going to blast it, you're going to paint it, that's another few, several hundred dollars. So, you know, if you want to revive a cooker, it can get under $3,000 real How quick. How long is that cooker? That thing's got to be a set. Got to be set. I don't even look at it. It's got to be set. Got years. to be. So, anyway, they are. They got this thing redone. It's got an insulated power hot. Look. These guys here, look at Kobe Cameron. Come here, come here. Look at Kobe Cameron. They got a dust thing on there trying to keep the dust out of it. That's trying right. To tighten it up. Look, I'm going to go ahead and tell you we can only keep your cooker so long, okay? We build them. We make them. We paint them, we clean them, we can't babysit them every day. So if they're not shipping, we're going to do the best we can. You see everything we got ready. If they don't ship, that ain't on us. You know, I'm That's just right. telling you, that ain't on me. That's so, right. Anyway, uh, here it is, buddy. It's, it's hard to keep this dust off these cookers. Did it go? Yes, sir. Very aggravating. Yes, sir. I mean, my Lord, next thing you know, you can have them in your house cleaning the dang ceiling fan. Come on. <laughs> anyway. This right here is life gear to get active for life. I get in that thing out here every morning come upside down. They say to shake my brain around a little bit and revamp me, reprogram my brain. Because they think I'm crazy. But I am. And I am. So anyway, again, no, guys, I, I'm having fun. This is what we do. This is some slick stuff. It you is. You think about it. This is some slick stuff, man. I don't care what you say. You can talk about us, hate us, or you can love us. This is some slick stuff. And it's not just this cooker. It's that 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 cooker. That cooker. And all those other cookers up top Amen. except one that we're working on to help somebody out. That's right. So anyway, again, it's power shirt. How long been going, Ralph? 17. Say, oh, oh, don't tell me. 13 minutes. 17 minutes. Good Lord. All right, I got to go because this thing will be hard to load up. I'm out of here, guys.